Hello everyone and welcome to Raina Moe's DIY and It Designs. Today we have a couple of things that we're going to discuss. First things first, I know the last video that I created, I told you that I was thinking about uh, starting a second channel and I have done that. I haven't uploaded anything uh, and I'm debating as to whether or not it'll be this particular tutorial. But the name of that particular uh, channel is going to be Raina Moe's World TV. And there you'll see that I'll be doing fashion and makeup, things for me learning, uh, extra things that I'll be doing for my wedding like my makeup. If I don't have to have a makeup artist on that day, I should be able to do my own makeup. And since I've ordered good gobs of stuff, once that starts coming in, on that channel you'll see what I've ordered, what I've received. It'll be hauls for the wedding, things of that nature, and also home decor and style and fashion. So having that said, our project today will be the first in the series for um, Z Gallery. And what I'm going to be creating today is going to be a long, beautiful table hold, uh, excuse me, candle holder. I saw this candle holder for Z Gallery on another YouTuber's uh, channel. I believe it's Kelia Decorates. And she was talking about a haul that she had done with a girlfriend and someone had blessed her with something similar. But she showed the picture from Z Gallery of this particular um, candle holder. So I went to ZGallery.com and I found it there. And obviously they had it in gold and in silver. I prefer the gold. So I'll be inserting a picture of that in... Um, in this tutorial so you'll see what the inspiration is so basically I've just gone and I have picked up a branch at my parents house from a pecan tree and you will see uh, my next step with that as far as making it the color that I want but I wanted to share with you this website because it's where I found the second part that's gonna go to that particular um, is gonna go to that particular project and it's from the website judaica.com and basically that is a website that is geared more towards uh, the Jewish faith because they had a lot of stuff that I didn't know what it was but I googled Bobesh's because the inspiration piece actually is votive holders and I can know that I can go to the Dollar Tree and get the glass votive holders that they have but I didn't like the way that looked on that um, ceramic branch for Z Gallery. I felt like it just wasn't classy enough for my tastes so I was looking for Bobesh's to see how I could dress it up and I came up with these at judaica.com so mine will actually be a taper candle holder so when uh, you come when we come back I'm going to show you how I spray painted the uh, branch that I chose and then next I'll show you how I go ahead and I attach these to the project okay here you see me shaking up the can and spraying with the uh, gold spray paint which I purchased at Walmart and it's Rust-Oleum brand and it said bright gold. I was a little afraid of that but uh, I'm really glad that I picked it out because it happened to match the color of the Bobeches perfectly. So I'm just going to spray the branch uh, everywhere that I can see any of the natural wood color and then later on I will flip it over after it's dry and spray the other side um, and I've given it one and a half to two coats basically because you can see I'm um, spraying with long strokes and some short strokes but I'm making sure that I coat it very very well and it took me about two days to get this part done because here in Texas, it's very cold and humid at the same time. You see, I have spray painted this very, very long branch from the pecan tree at my parents' house, which I'll decide uh, fitting on my dining room table. This is definitely long enough, um, but if I decide that I want to put it on a round table or in the kitchen, then I'll probably go ahead and cut um, the branch. 
Okay, so now you're going to see me use hot glue to apply the bobeches to the branch in the areas that I would like for them to sit. So this will be the first area. And then I'm going to place on these two branches here. And if you notice this particular branch, I thought that was interesting that two branches were diagonally across from each other. And this one, this one was broken off, but this one wasn't and it extends out. I really like the way that looks, but to kind of keep conformity, I may choose later to actually cut that branch off. Enjoy how the bobeches match almost exactly the color of the spray paint that I used and that uh, is just pure coincidence because I didn't take the bobeches to the store to match the, the spray paint. As you can see everything's flowing very well so I'm going to go ahead and continue to apply the bobeches and I'll come back and show you the final look. Here you will see from zgallery.com the inspiration piece. This is a ceramic branch. It is not real wood. And you can see the votive holders that they have embedded within this particular piece. It keeps everything nice and low if that's a look that you enjoy. But for me, I just feel that a nice tapered candle makes any table look absolutely elegant. This is what the project looks like so far. I have the babeshes attached. So the next thing will be to show you what it actually looks like in a small tablescape with the candles. I'm very pleased with how it's turned out. And it was really quick and simple. Final reveal. I've added some garlands that I picked up online, some Dollar Tree ribbon, and fairy lights that I got from Amazon. Once you play with the garland and fluff it up, it is so, so pretty. Now with my assistant's help, we're going to dim the lights so you can see the full effect. And look how gorgeous. So, on that note, if you like this particular tutorial, please give us a thumbs up, subscribe, and more importantly, share and comment down below. Let me know what your thoughts are, if there's anything I could have improved on, or if you think it was it's just really beautiful. Um, also, if you have any thoughts that uh, you would like for me to create, any ideas? Also, if you have any thoughts, put them down in the comments, and I will see what I can do. So on that note, have a wonderful evening. Goodbye. Raina Moe's DIY and it Design Creation. Z Gallery Inspiration Piece. Well, guys. <laughs> Here you can look at them both together. How did I do? I think it looks pretty good.